for Jack Walker, the full back, last tackle, back to Myler, Buchanan will throw it out wide and it looked forward, Moon kicks it inside and Myler picks it up and the referee is not going to even reference a forward pass for the touch judge, being ignored by the referee. So quick with the Bulls since 2012, spent time with the, uh, with the Rhinos since 2012 but has been on loan with the Bradford Bulls. He's almost got over the Leeds try line there, he's a metre away when he gets on plays the ball. Fairbank to have another go. Takes three to pull him down, Halifax looking still for the first opportunity. Wilmar to Morel, Tangata takes it, Halifax losing ground nine metres away. Referee indicating the last tackle, Kieran Moss. Kick is for Tyra, and Tyra's got the ball again from a crossfield kick by Scott Morell and took the ball down. Steve Tyra. Sixteen try of the season. Well, a timely return after three weeks out for Steve Tyra. Well, opposition clubs can watch that on the video all season long and we'll find that when Morell kicks across the field to Steve Tyra Steve Tyra usually comes up with a try and no problem for Steve Tyra well the Leeds Rhinos may have something to cheer about as Halifax move out quickly Walters is tackled. Goal line defence being tested right from the off and being breached. Scott Morell screaming at his teammates, saying, but it looks like I think it's Milo that's got his second try. On Sutcliffe obliges with a simple conversion. Well, I'm not sure who touched that, but uh, referee saw Halifax hand on it. Cuthbertson for the Halifax line, dragged down. And leads close to the line, off goes Dwyer again. And it looks like the second half is uh, beginning to belong to Brad Dwyer. Sutcliffe off through the middle and nobody's going to stop Luke Sutcliffe, uh, Liam Sutcliffe this time well the gap just opened up there for Sutcliffe Leeds team that's done so one and done and won so much in the last five or six years the Rhinos on a rebuilding process Sutcliffe away to Jordan Thompson and Thompson put down Halifax struggling to bring down the ball carrier on that occasion and opportunities out wide coming back inside and this surely must be another try for the lead Rhinos as Halifax defence is uh, tested but becoming tired after chasing the game in the second half and it's only just out to the left hand side of the upright so it shouldn't be too difficult Well, stamped his foot down and thought he was going to go forward then, but uh, stopped by the Halifax defence and Ben Kane Tangata. Well, that was just a, a lazy pass which looked to go forward. Halifax are caught again. You would have thought they were winning. No tears this time for uh, Sutcliffe from the touchline. 